The latest storm recovery center just opened in San Luis Obispo. News Channel reporter Dave Alley shows us what kind of help is now available. Hundreds of San Luis Obispo County residents suffered some sort of damage from recent storms. Now they have a place to turn to for much needed assistance as they begin the recovery process. Like the rest of the Central Coast, San Luis Obispo County was hit hard by recent storms. Now for many hit the hardest, they're still reeling in the aftermath. And it's difficult after you've been through a traumatic event such as this and you've lost, some people lost everything. Now comes a chance to recover through potential federal assistance, a sometimes daunting process. We've actually talked to a lot of residents who are really confused by the process. You know, there's so many different agencies that they have to go to. To help them out, a disaster recovery center is now open at the San Luis Obispo County Veterans Memorial Building. We have agencies here from the local, state and federal level, um, anywhere from the DMV to the USDA to County Behavioral Health to planning and building. It's a one-stop shop for information regarding storm recovery resources. It gives them a place to go if they have questions, if they need answers to uh, things that they're not understanding. It's great to have a fit, someone to come your advocate and you meet face to face with. People have up to March 16th to apply for help from the FEMA Assistance Program. Which offers many things such as uh, rental assistance if you've had to move out of your home. Uh, can help you with uh, some simple repairs that you may have in your home. Maybe you've lost some of your personal belongings. If you've lost a vehicle or you damaged a vehicle, things of that sort. The center is now open seven days a week from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. There is no predetermined date on when this center will close. It will remain open for weeks or even months as long as the need remains here in San Luis Obispo County. In San Luis Obispo, I'm News Channel reporter Dave Alley.